chocolate loaf cake with blood orange glaze. To make this cake, you will need butter, sugar, baking powder, salt, vanilla extract, espresso powder, unsweetened cocoa powder, eggs, all-purpose flour, and whole milk. For the glaze, you'll need sifted confectioner sugar, blood orange juice, salt, and vanilla. To make the batter, combine the butter, sugar, salt, baking powder, vanilla extract, espresso powder, and cocoa powder. Beat with an electric mixer until the mixture is sandy and crumbly. And then add the eggs one at a time, beating well between each addition. You'll want to stop and scrape the bottom and sides of the bowl once or twice while adding the eggs. After the eggs are completely incorporated, add half of the flour. And mix just until no white streaks remain. And add all of the milk. followed by the remaining half of the flour. Should have a smooth, creamy batter once it is completely mixed. Pour the batter into a loaf pan. You can use an eight inch loaf pan or a nine inch loaf pan for this recipe. Bake at 350 degrees for 60 to 70 minutes. The internal temperature of the cake should be about 205 degrees. Run the blade of a knife along the edge of the pan between the cake and the pan to loosen, and then let the cake cool in the pan for 10 minutes before removing the cake to a wire rack to cool completely. To make the glaze, combine the sifted confectioner sugar, a splash of vanilla extract, and a pinch of salt, and then stir in two to three tablespoons of blood orange juice. This will not only give the glaze a vibrant pink color, it will also give it a subtle orange flavor. to be pourable but not runny. Once you've reached the desired consistency, spoon or pour the glaze over the completely cooled cake, letting it run across the top and down the sides. And then let the glaze set for at least 10 minutes before slicing and serving the cake. I hope you enjoyed this video. For more videos and recipes, please visit us at arkansasonline.com slash cooking.